Well, hello, this is Paul Feuerstein, Editor-in-Chief of Dentistry Today, and I have great friends in dentistry, and Sam Lau, how are you today? Absolutely. In the perio world, one of the things we have to deal with is periodontitis, and with all the innovations and all the patients doing everything that's supposed to do and flossing and this and everything else, is this still periodontitis? Actually, uh, <laughs> the World Health Organization puts periodontal disease as the sixth most prevalent disease in the world. And in the United States, we still rely on the CDC study that demonstrates that 47% of uh, patients over 35 have bone loss. Uh -huh. And when you get up, to, I'm in Florida, so when you get up to those folks that are 60 or above, it's like, it's like 67%. Wow. And we're not talking gingivitis. But, no, I'm talking we're talking we're talking periodontitis bone loss. So yeah, there's uh, still a lot in them their hills. So you know, so we're we're here working with Phillips today, and Phillips has some answers that have been pretty good, and I believe there's some new studies that Phillips has come up with. Right. Um, they're about to publish it, and it's kind of interesting. Well, a lot of studies are done on gingivitis. Right. This study was done on periodontitis. And you're aware of the AAP as these classifications. Two, three, four, five, yeah. So they're using stage one, stage two, which now is really early periodontitis, and the next level, which is early to moderate periodontitis. They ran this study over six months. And this is, uh, this is important to me because of patient convenience and compliance. I, from day one, have believed that power tooth brushing right. will be like a cell phone versus a rotary phone. So they did this study with a diamond clean, yeah. and they're basically looking... That's the Sonicare diamond clean. Sonicare yeah. diamond clean. So they're basically looking at you know manual tooth brushing versus the diamond clean, and they did it in stages, like at six weeks, oh, so I forth, see. and then they went all the way to six months. Wow. That's not an easy study to do, to keep patients in the study. And what they found is at the end of six months, when you're looking at the things that are important to me, I understand when they look at plaque, but when you're looking at parameters like gingivitis and bleeding on probing, it was 90 times better than a manual toothbrush over six months. Yes, it's, it's wonderful for people with periodontitis. It's going to have a, a positive effect. What about everyday people who may or may not have periodontitis? Is it a nice preventive? Is it, I mean, what's, what's the word? Well, and also Phillips has done those studies in the past looking at gingivitis. Uh -huh. Every patient on the face of this earth, if they can afford it or can have it, mm -hmm. should be using power brushes, should be using like a diamond clean with all those advantages with diamond clean and Bluetooth and these things like that. Well, I mean, affordability is a piece of the puzzle, but you know, in a general practice, if we're t treating patients, Sometimes some dentists will take this as part of their protocol and incorporate the Sonicare as part of their protocol and actually give it to the patient. That's what we advocate. Yeah. We advocate actually almost creating like a one price concierge and in with that you put in the you put in the power flosser, you put in right. the Sonicare diamond clean. Because I don't want patients having to make decisions on their own. Yes. And they won't. It's, and and they won't. No, they'll probably go I'll say, to the I'll least, say, the I'll least say, well, expensive. For your next birthday present, why don't you buy yourself a Sonic yeah. So, and, and Philips has some other beautiful products that they use also for healthcare. We not only have the power brushers, what else do we have? This is the area that excites me at the same level as the power brushers, and that is power flossers. Where Philips has moved up is these power flossers that have this quad device with this engineering. Right, it's very cool. Most studies show <laughs> that only 7% of the population that are patients of record floss. <laughs> if I can demonstrate that something like a power flosser is equivalent or more effective than floss, I know. It, I know it sounds sacrilege, <laughs> but it's true. And you're looking at 3x, three, 4x three X, X better than floss when you're looking at plaque, you're looking at bleeding and probing, and you're looking at gingivitis. Well, the, the big deal is, I mean, when people floss, they go like this, you know, snap, 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 snap. They're not following the shoe shine technique. Right. And I've used the, the, the new floss, so previously, there's like this little jet, 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 jet. It, like it is amazing, the, the engineering yeah, yeah. that went behind it 
when you see these videos, uh, and, and, and not only is it quad, it's pulsed. Yes, that's it. So that's the trick. Yeah. Many of these devices out around are not pulsed, but it's that pulse part, almost like a photoacoustic part, that really has the most effect. And I should mention that I've, I've used this new one. There's no little water bottle over here in a hose. It's all self-contained, which is right. really and that's nice. A, that's a fairly new one that's yeah. come out. That's a real you know, nice and that's uh, people doing it in the sh you know. You don't realize how many people do their oral hygiene in the shower. Yeah, you can just carry this. And here, you can carry it with you, you can do it in the shower. It's phenomenal. Yeah. So, Philips has done a great job. As long as everybody follows and complies with everything we tell them to do. Right, but when you have this kind of technology, you got a heck of a lot better chance they're going to do it than right. when you had the stuff that was 40 years ago. Truth. Before Philips Sam, 30 years. Great stuff. As always. Great stuff. Always enjoyed talking with you. Thank Thanks you. So